the medical marijuana dispensary and arrest the owners for supplying hundreds of clients. Supporters say they're following the law. Police say no, they're not. Crim 2 News at 6 starts now. Good evening. Thanks for being with us. I'm Randy Shaw. Two people under arrest tonight for allegedly violating Washington's medicinal marijuana law. Spokane police busted a dispensary for the first time and raided four homes this morning. Crimpton's Lee Stoll spoke to the dispensary owner, and she's live with why both say both sides of this law isn't clear. And about 50 dispensers, patients, and medicinal marijuana supporters are protesting outside City Hall right now. A dispensary owner we talked to today says she shut her doors, worried she may also be reading the code incorrectly. There's a lot of confusion. Chantel Jackson says there are seven medicinal marijuana dispensaries in Spokane, and all have been told, she says, by police to shut down until the code is clarified. Right now, police say state codes states a designated provider can only have one client at a time, but Jackson says dispensers interpret that as meaning they can only have one client during a certain time period, but can have several appointments a day. Police say they've seen more than a thousand people come in and out of the chain shop, which was busted this morning since they started surveillance three months ago. Jackson says she worries what will happen to patients with legitimate medical marijuana cards, but no suppliers. Uh, it forces them to the black market, and that's sad. These are very sick people that come in here for their medicine, and it's unfortunate that the places are being shut down. And again, about 50 medicinal marijuana supporters and patients outside of City Hall right now protesting the arrests from this morning. Jackson says these protesters will be out again Monday morning in front of the public health building. Reporting live, I'm Lee Stoll, Crime 2 News.